I'm James Spencer from Basic Brewing Video. Brewing beer with malt extract is a fun and easy way to get into home brewing. And by using specialty grains, you can take your extract brews to the next level and add some flexibility to your recipes. Specialty grains are grains, usually barley, that have been created to add flavor, color, and complexity to your beer. Unlike base malts that have to be mashed to convert starches into sugar, specialty grains can be steeped like tea in water to get the good stuff out. Here are some examples of specialty grains. Let's start with roasted barley. Roasted barley is just that, raw barley that's been kilned or roasted, kind of like coffee to get some interesting flavors. Chocolate malt is malted barley that's been roasted to a dark color to give chocolatey or coffee-like flavors. They look the same, but they taste different. Crystal malts have been prepared in a way that makes them sweet, and at the same time they can be roasted to varying levels of darkness. This color is measured on the Lovabon scale. For example, 20 Lovabon crystal is fairly light, 60 Lovabon is darker, and 90 Lovabon crystal is darker still. You can't tell much from looking at the grains themselves, but I've steeped these in water to show you the difference more dramatically. Each specialty grain brings its own color, flavor, and aroma characteristics to your beer, and it's fun to play with them. Using only a light extract, you can use specialty grains to make any number of styles of beer. So how do you use them? Well, first, you'll need to crush the grain to open up the kernels to the water. I put mine in a plastic bag and roll a rolling pin over the grains. You don't need to crush them into a powder, just crack them to open them up. Then put your grains in a grain bag. Tie the top and put them in your water. For consistency, I steep my specialty grains for around 30 minutes at 150 degrees Fahrenheit. That's around 65 degrees Celsius. Since we're only steeping and not mashing, temperature isn't as critical as in a mash time. At the end of the 30 minutes, pull the grain bag out, let it drip for a couple of minutes, and then toss it out. Grain makes great compost material, by the way. And that's it! Bring your water up to boil and add your malt extract as you normally would in a straight extract brew. Hope that helps. For lots more brewing info, check out byo.com or basicbrewing.com.